Modern portfolio theory is the quantified version of don't put all your eggs in one basket. Because if you were to put all your eggs in one basket and that basket was to get damaged, well, you might lose all your eggs. In finance, we use securities instead of eggs and we bundle a series of different securities together. That way, if some of the securities fall in value, other securities will rise in an equal amount, thus keeping the value of the portfolio the same. But as the market rises overall, so does the value of the portfolio with the rising tide of the market. Let's look at the Kellen Periodic Table of Investment Returns to understand the theory better. As you can see, the chart depicts the annual rate of return for each of the four asset classes, equities, fixed income, cash equivalents, and real estate. If you were to invest 100% of your money into a large cap in 1999, you would have earned 21.04%. But that very next year, you would have lost 9.11% for a two-year average of 5.97%. On the other hand, if you had split your investment between large cap and real estate, you would have earned 14.96 in 1999 and 4.73% as you can see by subtracting the 13.84% produced by the real estate investment from the negative 9.11% generated by the large cap equity position. So as you can see from the example, don't leave all your eggs in one basket. If you guys would like to learn more about retirement, click on the subscribe button.